everyone and welcome back to Fantasia. As you can see, I've taken down my Christmas decorations because it's no longer Christmas. I still have these lights up um, and I do want to take them down. I was originally going to keep these rainbow lights everywhere, but I think they just look, oh dear, I think they just look a little bit too Christmassy. So I do want to take them down and replace them, I think. I have some different lights that I can put up instead. All right, I have some white twinkly lights that I thought could be cool. I rem I made them a while back, but then I didn't like them at the time, but I don't know, maybe I, yeah, here we go. I have some white fairy lights with a twinkle pattern. Put these ones away. We'll see how these look instead. Something just a bit more neutral. Mm. I don't know, do they look too plain? I kind of wish they were a bit brighter. Let's see how they look here. I don't know. Maybe the rainbow ones were better, but they do look kind of Christmassy. Maybe I just need colorful lights, but like in different colors to the rainbow ones. I don't know. I'll do some experimenting um, off camera in a test world with different patterns and looks and things and see if I can find something that looks nice. Cause I, I don't know. I feel like I should keep the rainbow ones for Christmas. Or maybe I should do green and red ones for Christmas. Um, you know what? I'm going to put my rainbow ones back up for now. I really don't like the look of these white ones. They're just too boring. And maybe next Christmas I'll put um, green and red up instead of the rainbow ones. The rainbow ones are just really cute. Um, I really like them. So I'm going to put those back up for now. Oops. There we go. Oops. There we are. Don't they just look pretty? Like, I know they look kind of Christmassy, but they also just look cute and rainbowy. And also they do fit with my rainbow room that I have here. I don't know, I just think it's nice. Maybe I'll try a different color scheme at some other point, but for now we're doing rainbows. I think that was all of them, wasn't it? Yep. Oh, I had some, did I already put some up here in the en enchanting? Yeah, I did. I already have some up here. Okay, don't need any more. I'll put these ones away. Okay, ooh, speaking of while we're up there, I wanna see, do we have any more dino DNA? Let's see. Oh, uh, oh wait, wrong one. <laughs> here we go, oh, we're all out. Oh, and we have a Mosasaurus DNA and we're all out of DNA things. All we got was a Mosasaurus DNA and a bunch of bone meal, okay. So we have Stegosaurus, Ankylosaurus, Spinosaurus, two Mosasaurus, um, two Sturgeon, two Allosaurus, and a Dilophosaurus. I think I might want to get the Ankylosaurus. They're pretty cool looking. Um, yeah, I guess I'll, guess I'll put this bone meal in here for now. I don't think, I do have some more biofossils, but I don't want to use them all up because I'm pretty sure I need to use them to also cultivate um, stuff. But I think I can put plant fossils in and see what else we get out of those. Um, what other plant things, oops, we get, but I don't want to use my dinosaur bio, bio fossils because I'm pretty sure I use them to make dino eggs. Not that we're quite ready for that just yet. Um, we're getting there. Um, oh, uh, anyway, uh, what am I trying to say? I went and harvested a bunch of sugar cane so that we can make some more books. Um, and also to make name tags because today's tasks, I moved the task board out here rather than down there. It just made more sense. So today's tasks are to name the baby elephant, finally, name the new foal and to build a food storage area, um, below the food tree. Oh, look at pretty sunset over the land. Oh yeah. And, um, in the intro, I changed the design of the cow's shelter. I just didn't like the look of these other shelters I had. Because realistically, if the animals actually all wanted to shelter under there, they wouldn't fit. Whereas this bigger one, they would all fit. And I just, I think it looks nicer and it matches the elephants one. So I'm probably going to change the other ones over to that design. I just kind of wanted to try it out with one paddock first before I change all the others. But I think I like how it looks. Okay, let's sleep. And then I need to make some name tags. And I'm also going to make more bookshelves for my enchanting table. We're level 47! Oh, are you good? Yeah, you're good. Okay. So, pretty sure a name tag is just iron and paper. Yep. Do I have any paper already? 
I have two. Okay. And I don't have any spare name tags. It doesn't look like. Alright. Let's just we'll turn this all into... I guess... Yeah, we'll turn it all into paper. Um... Was it just this way? Yep. Okay, we'll make two of these. And then we need to make a bunch of books. Okay, yeah, I do have a spare book here. Alright. Um, is this how we do it? Yep. Yeah. Sometimes I forget because recipes have changed depending on what version you're playing in. Um, I can't remember if I can make bookshelves using this wood or not. Let's see. Can I? Yes, I can. Yeah, because this version doesn't have... Um, different types of bookshelves, it only has the one type. But that's okay. Oh, whoops, I forgot to put the extra books in. There we go. Okay, we have three more bookshelves. Uh, yeah. It's gonna take a while to get all the bookshelves I need. Wait, wait, wait. Do I have four books? Oh, okay, so I can make some more then. Um, I just need to get some more wood. Oh, might as well Oh, actually, I'm gonna hold on to that. Oops. All right. I didn't, oops. There we go. Okay, so four more bookshelves. It takes so much sugar cane. Okay. We'll just line the back here, I guess. I don't know if I'm going to make it three high or just have it too high. I think having it three high could look better, although if I have it only two high, I could put stuff on top of the bookshelves. But I'm not sure if it really makes a difference. Let's see what's in the... Oh, we got coal. Fossilized horsetail spores and fossilized temp skyer spores and sand. I don't know if we've gotten the temp skyer spores before. Yeah, we have. Okay. And some coal. That's cool. And another petrified paleo raft sapling. I think these are the only... I think I've already gotten all the kinds I can get, but I do not mind having multiples because I don't know if I can, like, re... like, get saplings or whatever. I don't know. Let's put some stuff away. I don't need sand. Okay, I think I have... Nope, I need a... Do I need a shovel? No, I need dirt. I do have some dirt. We'll grab a little bit more dirt, just in case. I need more. I think we're good to go now. Oh, I need to use... Uh, name the name tags. Okay, so... So I was originally planning to come up with a fruit name for the other elephant to match with peaches, but then I thought it'd be kind of weird because one would be plural and one would be single. Um, so I decided I think I'm going to go with cream in, oops, yeah, cream, what, no, oh, caps lock is on, cream instead. So it's like peaches and cream because they go well together. It's like a dessert. And then for Blaze and Rain's baby, I was thinking maybe something weather related and the name Breezy just came to mind. So we're going to call her Breezy. So it's kind of like Blaze, Rain, Breezy, I don't know. It just seemed to fit. So that's what we're going to call the baby. Okay, let's go name these guys. Oh, and yes, I do have my elephant with me. Okay, do I have food for the dogs? Yes, I do. Do I have food for me? Yes, I do. Oh, I should put these. Oh, I already have a bunch of potatoes. Okay. Um, oh, that's the other thing I need. I need barrels for the food storage area before we go in here. Um, I took down the village's Christmas decorations and put them back into the deco bench. I stored my own Christmas decorations in a um, cupboard so I don't have to find them again, but I have took away the village's ones because I'm mean. Um, okay, so we can have a barrel for carrots, a barrel for potatoes. Um, there's... Isn't one for wheat or for melons or anything? I don't think these crates here can be um, used for storage. Yeah, I don't think you can store stuff in them. Um, it's a sack. What about the other crates? Yes, yeah, so there's these crates as well. But I don't think you can use these for storage. Let me just have a look. No, you can't. And the whole point was that I wanted to be able to store the stuff. Um, so I guess we'll just get plain barrels for the other stuff. So, so we'll have car uh, potatoes, carrots. I guess I could store my melons in this green apple one. Um, 
golden apples. Uh, I guess we'll store pumpkins in another barrel and wheat will be in a barrel and sugarcane will be in a barrel. Um, I'm trying to think what else I have there. Um, oh, I've also got the Geisel greens. I guess they can go in a red barrel. I think that's everything. If I've forgotten anything, I can always come back and get it. But carrots, potatoes, wheat, melons, pumpkins, sugar cane, the Geisel greens. I think that's everything. Um, should I get some of these like crate things for decoration maybe? Maybe? Or maybe I should actually have, oh, I don't know. Hmm. Now I think we'll just start with the barrels for now. So I'm going to use these in my storage area. Oh, maybe I could use the... I wish there was like a barrel for everything, but there isn't. Um, you know, I might get the golden apple one and put wheat in that. I'll see how it looks. If I don't like the look of it, I can always just use a regular barrel. Let's get the barrel of golden apples. Alright, now I think I've got everything I need, and I need to remember to not use my axe because I'm pretty sure I have tree capitator mod on. Um, and so if I use my axe, um, then uh, I'll end up chopping the whole food tree down. Tilly, okay, you're set to follow me. Alright, let's go release my elephant and name some animals. Fairly certain I've got everything that I need. Oh, hi Tilly. All right, we'll name the baby first, which I think she's almost full grown. Oh yeah, she looks like she's full grown now. Hi baby, hi Blaze. Yeah, I'm also gonna change their shelter to the new design, I think. This is gonna be breezy, are you? I think you're nearly, oh no, she is full grown. Oh, she looks like she's gonna be fast too. Okay, um, so we're gonna name you, oh actually, do I want you to be a boy? She looked like a girl as a foal, but maybe you're a boy. Now that I'm looking at this horse, I'm starting to think it looks more like a boy than a girl. But what would I name you if you were a boy? Um. No, we're just going to stick with Breezy and you can be a girl. <laughs> you can be a mare. Okay, and now we're going to go release my elephant. I guess she's just a mare that looks like her dad more. <laughs> Alright. Oh, and I need to put torches in here. I noticed it's very dark in like there's there's no light sources here. Um okay, wolves do not follow me in here, please. Do not teleport in here. I do not need you guys going to the nether. No 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 okay, wolves out, 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 out. Out. I do not need you guys going to the nether again. Wolfie! Okay, there we go. We'll just have a... I can't put torches on top of here. No, I can't. Let's have torches on either side here. There we go. That should light that up a bit. And this area here doesn't have any torches either. Let's put some torches there. Uh, I think I want that. Yeah. Okay. Come on in. Come on. Come on, wolves. Okay. Oops. Oops. Peaches, I have a surprise for you. I really need to do something about those tree ants that are living here with peaches. They're just, they're stuck. <laughs> but I'm kind of scared to try to free them because they might get stuck. What? Did I just hear something? No? Okay. Peaches, I know, Peaches, I have a surprise for you. Look! You are a mama! Oh, wait. Okay, I do have baked potatoes. I <laughs> freaked out for a second. Oh, and I just wasted a name tag that I didn't need. I don't need a name tag for this. Okay, anyway, here's the baby elephant. No, no. Are you telling me I can't tame this baby elephant? Is it regular potatoes? Wait, no, no, no. Oh my gosh, I made this mistake last time. It's not potatoes, it's sugar lumps. What is wrong with me? Why do I keep making this mistake? I hope the baby's still baby enough that I can tame it once I wake up and go get some sugar lumps. This is the same mistake I made last time. I need sugar lumps to him. I just hope it's still young enough. It looks like it's still young enough. <sighs> Hold on, Peaches. Um, I will be back with your baby. 
I just need to go get some more sugar cane because I used all mine up. I can't believe I've made this mistake twice now. That's embarrassing. Oh yeah, that's right. I have conflicting mods. Okay, so I'm just gonna make, uh, can I make, okay, I need more sugar. I'm just gonna make the sugar blocks and then I will um, transfer those into, I don't know how many sugar lumps I'm gonna need. I'm gonna make some more. Um, and then I'll transfer those into sugar lumps since it takes the same um, amount. Okay. So if we just grab that, get rid of that. Just quickly grab me some sugar lumps. One, two, three, four. And, oh no, I need five. Oops. That's five. And then get rid of those five sugar cubes. There we go. Perfect. Did I also get back my sugar, the spare sugar I had? Also, what's this for? I don't know. Um, okay, let's go. Hopefully, hopefully five sugar lumps is enough to tame my baby elephant. Oh, hi there, Zachariah, the library. Oh my gosh. Oh, ugh. These zombie people bit me. I thought Zachariah bit me for a second. I was like, why would you? Oh, someone just gave, oh, Zachariah gave Wolfie some pork chops. How nice. Thank you. Okay, let's go tame this baby elephant. I wasted a name tag on her. I can, I mean, I can always rename the name tag, but still, I didn't need it in the first place. All right, let's try this again. My wolves with me? Yep. Let's try this again. Peaches, let me introduce you to your new baby. Um, let me get my sugar lumps ready. All right. Release. And then, yes. No. Um, um, need more sugar. There's a sugar cube. Um, Need another sugar lump. I think they need a lot of sugar lumps. Um. Here. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I think it's like 10 or something. Okay. We need a lot more. Oh wait, there's sugar cane here. We need a lot more sugar cane and a lot more sugar. Because I think it needs like 10 sugar lumps or something now that I think of it. And I don't know if those will reset now that I've put her back in the Pokeball. But I just didn't want her to grow up because I can only tame baby elephants. So, that's concerning. <laughs> I'm not prepared for this at all. All right. I think it was 10, wasn't it? I can't remember. All right. Uh, let's just put some stuff away. And you know what, actually, while I wait for... Oh, I know, Peaches, I keep teasing you with a baby elephant and then taking her away. I'm so sorry. Uh, while I wait for more sugar cane to grow, I guess I'll go work on the... um the food storage area that I was building. <laughs> now let's build this up. Oh, and there's like a hole under the tree. That's not good. Okay, move please. Oh, and he's a bit hungry. Will you eat chicken? I think you'll eat chicken, won't you? It's a good thing I put my ax away so that I'm not tempted to accidentally use it on the tree because it will chop the entire thing down. All right. Um, I think that's good for now. Let's move that torch. Have them like here. And then we're gonna have a little storage area inside of the tree. Here we go. Or should it be like this way? I feel like it makes more sense to have it here. Alright, so we're just gonna hollow this tree out. Alright, here we go. This is as big as the storage room can be. Um, it's definitely smaller than I thought. Thought. I kind of forgot just how small these trees are. Like, they're big, but they're not that big. Um, but that's okay. It should be enough, uh, big enough for all my barrels. So, I guess we'll alternate. Where did my fruit barrels go? Oh, did I put them in my backpack? I did. Okay. I guess we'll alternate between, like, a colourful barrel and a non-colourful barrel or something like that. I don't know. Okay, so, we've got barrel for carrots. 
Um, his oops, one for wheat. Oh no. Um. Okay, we'll have barrel for potatoes. This one could be for wheat. Um, can a barrel fit that? Yeah, it can. This one can be for melons. Um, Geisel greens, and I guess we'll have pumpkins and sugarcane. I kind of want to alternate the, like, what if I have these ones in the corners? I think that would look better. And then the, oops. What, why can't that go there? Oh, the torch is in the way. We'll just move the torch. Like, up there. Um, and then this. I think that looks nice, yeah? I think that looks pretty good. Okay, so I have some potatoes I can put in here. So these have a lot of storage. I guess I'll go <gasps> cake wolf. Oh, I really want it, but I don't need it. I'll go harvest some stuff so that I can put it in the barrels, but I think those look nice. I'm not gonna harvest it, like all of them. I'm just gonna harvest like one little section. And I don't know if I have beets in this version or not. Unsure. Um, we'll just put a single sugarcane here just to mark this is the sugarcane one. Oh, it's all glitched. Dang it. Um, this is wheat. This, uh, no, this one is melon. Um, what? Oh, and this one's pumpkins. And that's carrots. So I'll have sugarcane on that side, pumpkins on that side. Um, that'll be geysel greens, wheat, my melons, my potatoes, some more in there. Okay, I think that's good. I hate how the UI glitches, and yeah, I'm gonna put a door here. Okay, Tilly, help me make a door, please. There we go. Ah, it's so cute. I wish these barrels had stuff in them too, but it still looks cute. All right, doggies. Um, let's see. How much sugar cubes can I make? Oh my gosh. I'm still so like slight, like, ah, I don't have enough sugar lumps. And I don't know if the Pokeball resets the amount. <sighs> All I wanted to do, <laughs> something so simple. Oh, Cake Wolf. I don't have any cakes though. I should make some cakes so I can get a Cake Wolf, but that would mean another wolf enclosure I need to make, and I still have a coal wolf that needs an enclosure. But how fun would it be to make an enclosure for the cake wolf? I could make it a giant cake to live inside of. That'd be so cute. Wouldn't it? Like, as its little house, it could have a cake. <laughs> okay. Oh, what just- Wolfie- how do you keep hurting yourself? I need to get, I need to level up Wolfie more. There's a thing called Pillow Paw, which um, limits the amount of fall damage he can take. Have the sugar cane over here grown? One of them has. I'm so sorry, Peaches, about your baby. <laughs> I'm trying. Oh, there's one more sugar cane. I don't think I have any more sugar at home. I guess I can double check. You know what, the more I think about it, the more I just, keep seeing that horse and think of it as a stallion instead of a mare so i'm gonna rename him using this name tag i was gonna use on the baby elephant i think i want something weather related or i could have something similar to blaze like i could have flame or i could have lightning or I like lightning. We'll do that. And it suits him because he's a buckskin. He can be lightning. Um, yeah. I just <laughs> Breezy seemed to suit when it was a foal, but not anymore now it's an adult. Oh, and do I have sugar in here? It's kind of impossible to see anything, but it looks like I do not. Oh <gasps> I have 44 sugar cane in here. How did I not know about this? Oh my gosh. Okay, we're gonna make, I don't wanna use all of it on sugar because um, I also need to make bookshelves. We're just gonna make enough sugar 
to make um, uh, to make ten sugar blocks that I can turn into ten sugar lumps because I'm not sure if the pokeball is going to reset um, the taming process um, and I don't want to risk um, not having enough sugar lumps just in case it does so let's get rid of those and we'll get my sugar lumps I'm fairly certain it's 10. I should probably double check that, but I'm not going to. <laughs> Worst case scenario, I still have some more sugar cane on me. But oh, we're going to finally go tame the elephant. And where are my dogs? My dogs are just out here. What are you guys doing? Oh, Tilly fell down with me. <laughs> Oops. Did I sit you down? I did. You go. Okay. Well, we got to rename this horse because it's not going to be breezy anymore. It's going to be lightning. I thought about flame, but lightning just, lightning makes sense to me. So you are now lightning. Yep, that suits way better than breezy. Hopefully he's fast, because then that will also suit the name lightning, like lightning fast. All right. Now let's go finally tame this baby elephant. Who knew it would be such a task just to tame a baby elephant? Peaches, <laughs> I'm back with your surprise. I'm, oh. Oh my gosh, I nearly panicked. The elephant's in this one. <laughs> okay. There you go, baby elephant. Let's tame you. No. Come on. <gasps> yes! Okay, and now we're going to name this baby Cream. So we have Peaches and Cream. There we go, finally! And look, she's been, she grew as she was eating the um, sugar cubes. Hi, baby Peaches! I mean, not baby peaches, baby cream. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna sleep. I, I think I clearly need some sleep. My brain is not working well. Can I sleep, please? Can I sleep, please? Peaches, are you gonna say hi to your new baby? Your new adoptive baby? There we go. Let's see you two. Peaches, come say hi to your baby. Go on, go on over cream. Go say hi to your mama. It's your adoptive mama. Go bond. They're the same species of elephant. I wanted a different species, um, but that's okay. I don't mind that they're the same species because I like this one better, the model of this elephant better. Tilly, can you not? I'm trying to take a cute picture of these two. Oh, look at you. You're bonding. Oh, dear. Careful, cream. Okay, mama peaches is going to take good care of you. Oh my goodness, this makes me so happy. Cream was an orphan just like you. Well, sort of, I kind of. <laughs> Child Protective Services came and took Cream away because her mum was being negligent and not supervising her around water. <laughs> so you need to take good care of her Cream, I mean Peaches, <laughs> and make sure she's safe around the water. It's only shallow, but you still gotta be protective. Oh, look at them, they're so cute together. Oh, this makes you so happy. Happy elephants. All right, well, I am going to go ahead and end this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up as well as subscribe and hit the notification bell. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a video. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.